Okay, so we're starting inside the house. You can see the uh, the, the breaker box. Where it and was. Where it was. Well, that's where the door was. They okay. took it off. All right. That's where we had wasps coming in yesterday that we had to had to exterminate, unfortunately. Okay. Move the cat. Okay. And then here is the, tr well. So this is the box. Hang on, hang on. The hang on, she ah. just got out. Betty, come here. All right. So this is the damage on the house. Hold my umbrella down. But we had this really old tree here that is now two trees. Unfortunately, it's going to have to go. Yeah. It's going to have to go. You can see the power lines are down. And this is a bummer because this was a really cool tree. It was really cool for a couple different reasons. It bled. I yeah. really liked that. I thought that was dope. But yeah, that used to be one tree. Yeah, you see how far that went down in there? Yeah. Here, that's how far the split goes down into the into the ground. Hmm. It's a shame. This is all going to have to come down now. I'm telling you, just like this has settled over the last couple days. Mm -hmm. But all of this, when it happened, when I came out here the first day it happened, this was all tousled up. So when it hit the tree, it came down, split it. The tree had to have jumped. Right. Like, because this was all all messed up right around mm -hmm. there. And you can still kind of see it a little bit. Well, you can definitely see it's raised up. Yeah. yeah. But the whole thing, it hit and it jumped. But, uh, yeah. And there's the power lines that were also taken out. Shout out to the neighbors again. They, they've been so mm -hmm. kind on giving us an extension cable. So mm -hmm. we can plug in our fridge and charge our phones. So that's all we've done is yep. fridge and phones. That's it. Because we're not trying to run up their bill either. Okay. Yeah. Thanks. But they're they're very, very 